needs the big fancy retail stores when you have the Germantown Festival? For 40 years, even the pickiest of shoppers are happy with the amazing selection of products to redecorate their home inside and out. John Engel is the owner of a business called Mud Puddle, a business that creates unique items made out of recycled oil drums and car parts. He travels every weekend to craft festivals all over the country. Everything is made out of recycled materials, either recycled oil drums or car parts. Most of it, all of them are baked on paint, just like a car, so they do hold up outside. That's a good thing about it too, not only is it neat like an art piece in your yard, but you're also giving back to the environment too soon. Artist Treva Richards owns Vonet Design, a business that specializes in paintings rich in color. Her first year at the Germantown Festival, this Memphis College of Art graduate says she can complete one painting in as much as three days. I haven't uh, exposed them as much like I would like to, but uh, a lot of people who have seen my art, they, they love everything that I do. As you walk through the festival grounds, you'll see some very unique items. Handcrafted driftwood birdhouses, stone clay pottery, and stuffed sports pillows. Interesting. Doug Lamb makes spoons and has been doing so for 26 years. Handmade carved kitchenware out of cherry, walnut, oak, and maple. Interestingly, he makes them for both right and left-handed cooks. He makes a good living. Well, I've always been a hunter and a fisher, and there's a group of people that do rustic houses and cabins and stuff like that, and they really enjoy having the antler fitted up to their spoons and stuff. From antler back scratchers to recycled pig grills, if you can't find it at the Germantown Festival, it simply doesn't exist. For GHS-TV, I'm Justin Waldrop. Ooh, that feels good. <laughs>